Hi, I'm Lori Marrero, creator of the Clutter Diet book and online program, and my definition of getting organized includes being prepared, being ready for whatever life throws your way. So I want to share with you today some tools that are exactly the right thing in the right circumstance. Now, while I tend to discourage the use of single-use gadgets that have not very many purposes, there are some tools that justify themselves. They justify the space that they take up because when you need them, they save so much time and so much money and so much stress that they are fantastic to have around. But these things I'm going to show you are a little obscure and that's why I want to share them with you because you might not know about them and I love them. So first, the uh, the smallest one, this one's called a Teeny Turner and it's a really well-designed little set of screwdrivers that are teeny and you can use those for children's toys if you have little battery compartments or electronics often there are very small screws that you have to remove and it's perfect for that if you can't find this exact one you can get an eyeglass repair kit that works pretty much the same way anyway this is very handy to have around another thing is uh, a couple of different little grabbers now if you drop a sock behind the dryer or between the washer and the dryer sometimes that can be really hard to get out without moving everything um, also if you drop a ring down the sink and it falls into the little s trap well you really don't want to get the big wrench out and remove the pipes this is found in the plumbing department of your uh, home improvement center and it's flexible and you squeeze it on the end this little fork thing comes out and squeezes whatever you are trying to grab so you can bend this thing where you want it and grab something and pull it out so think about how much money and time that would save for just the right situation very similarly there is this grabber that a member of my family got um, after hip replacement surgery so they didn't want the person to bend over very much and you can just grab anything off of a high shelf or on the ground and a different type of grabbing. So something behind the sofa, something that's fallen behind the freezer drawer on the bottom that's you know fallen on the floor underneath the refrigerator. Perfect for that and such a lifesaver. So here's the best one that you might not know about. So everybody knows what this is, but you might not know what to do when the plunger doesn't work. And I'm really lucky because my dad is very handy and he taught me a long time ago about a plumber's auger. It's also known as a plumber's snake. And I have some pictures of it here. It's kind of hard for me to depict right here holding in front of the camera, but you can see that it is a coiled long, piece of wire that goes down the pipes of the toilet and when the plunger can't reach it this thing actually goes through and pushes a clog out so you you plunge it down and twist the handle around and it gets out almost anything that's clogging your toilet so that is $35 in your plumbing department of your hardware store and think about what you save for all the different plumbers visits uh, that are unnecessary now when you have a plumber snake. So it has saved me so many times. It definitely justifies the space it takes up in my garage. So I know you've got your favorites too. So please share in the comments. I'm always interested to learn about these obscure kinds of tools that make life easier. And I would love to hear about that. So see you next time and may you always be happy and grateful for having more than enough. Mm -hmm.